this is a discussion of the Schumann resonance tuning. Most modern music is tuned with the A note above middle C at 440 hertz, 440 cycles per second. The Schumann resonance, which is a measure of the Earth's natural electromagnetic frequency, has a fundamental tone of 7.83 cycles per second. If you if you use that for the musical scale, then the A above middle C becomes 430.65 hertz. And what I'm going to do now is demonstrate some of the um, chords, how they sound based on the 430.65 hertz scale. There's a curious movement in some musical circles to use a different frequency scale for standard notes. In modern times, we've settled upon a standard centered on the fundamental of eight cycles per section, per second, which results in the A note above middle C measured at 440 cycles per second. The alternative to 440 hertz offered by this movement is defined defines the A note at 432 cycles a second, which is slightly lower than the musical standard. This is called uh, Verdi's A note, as he preferred the lower tones so that his singers could reach the higher notes like middle C. Proponents of the revives, revived musical structure for the 432 cycle tone is, is beneficial. They, they claim it's beneficial, and I'll give you some quotes according to Richard Huskin, music tuned at 432 hertz is softer and brighter, giving greater clarity and it's easier on the ears. According to Ananda Bosman, international researcher and music, musician, archaic Egyptian instruments that have been unearthed are largely tuned to A at 432 hertz. Ancient Greeks tuned their instruments predominantly to 432 hertz. 432 hertz seems to work at the heart chakra, the feeling, and therefore, therefore could have a good influence on spiritual development of the listener. These are referred to in reference number one. These claims might be considered subjective and difficult to prove. Some researchers have, researchers have offered a counter points to these arguments, which are referred to in reference two. Nevertheless, the switch to 432 hertz appears to be growing in popularity. Some folks even use tuning forks at the frequency, which they claim has healing properties. An internet search on the topic reveals quite an intense debate on this subject. The best known planetary or earth frequency is called the Schumann resonance, which is variable, but resides around 7.83 7 hertz or cycles per second. This is a bit slower than the 8 hertz favored by the movement that we just mentioned. If we use the Schumann resonance of 7.83 as a musical scale, then Verdi's A note would be 430.65 cycles per second. It's pretty darn close to the 432 cycles per second that this movement uh, proposes. I've created a chart that shows the frequencies based on the Schumann resonances, and I've tuned my guitar to that to those uh, frequencies. The Schumann res resonance is actually a relatively broad range of frequencies centered around 7.83 hertz. There are also several m nodes at higher frequencies. These resonances, moreover, fluctuate with changes in the sun's solar wind and related factors. The fundamental mean frequency can be used for exploration and research to see if it's any more effective than the nearby 432 hertz. For research purposes, I've created a chart for musical notes on the fundamental Schumann frequency. The notes in the chart yield a Verdi's A note of 430.65 hertz. Of course, with piano and guitar tuning, the exact precision of frequencies is not possible so we tune to the nearest whole whole uh, cycle per second 
Since the Schumann resonance is relatively broad, this design should put the instrument tuning right in the middle of the Schumann resonance range. I suspect too that the much heralded 432 hertz tuning will work pretty well due to the variance in the fundamental frequency. Anyway, using this model, I produced a demonstration of sounds based on the 8.3 Schumann resonance using my baritone ukulele. Take a listen and see what you think. And I encourage other people to experiment with this and um, report back or let us know or print whatever you want to do to uh, shed light on this interesting subject. Thank you. D G B E D G B E D G B E A note, A chord, C chord, D chord, F chord, G chord, Thank you.